a lot of surgeons now are saying they have the artist robot and they can do surgery. Now, what you have to know is it's not a robot that comes in and just and just starts doing surgery and you put your head in something and then like a washing machine and you come out and you have a head full of hair. It's not like that at all. The artist is a system that actually somebody has to be involved to actually select the hair, punch and do FUE and actually someone personally will extract the hair but the artist can make the sights and but it can't put the hair in. Now, what the difference is, what people have to think is that there are a lot more steps involved in hair transplantation other than just punching out hair and putting it in. The biggest steps are when you see the patient for the first time is making the diagnosis. So just because you have a machine that can automate a lot of the procedure for you, if you choose the wrong candidate, if you don't know how to design hairlines, if you can't diagnose what's wrong with the scalp, what good would any type of apparatus be to make holes in your head and put hair in because it's not going to work. And especially if you don't have any expertise as how to design the hairline, how to design these patterns. It's kind of like art and you develop this over time. So I'm not, the artist I think is a wonderful device, but the artist by itself will not make you Babe Ruth of hair transplantation.